hello great people welcome to financial power youtube channel and in today's video i'll be talking about some things that you need to pass some tests you need to pass if you want to make money in 2023 these are tests you need to pass and i wrote them down like about five tests i need to pass you see money is never enough now because of the way human needs are where our needs are insatiable can never be satisfied take for instance now you are earning hundred thousand naira as a salary by the time you are paid two hundred thousand naira it will still not be enough okay let me even start from um let's say 30k and by the time it is increased to fifty thousand naira you will still, it will not be enough for you by the time it increased to hundred thousand naira it will still not be enough for you but by the time it's increased to two hundred thousand naira you might be saying oh don't worry let, let me just make it two hundred thousand every month it will still not be enough you just cover that it's no longer enough after a short while but when you're not collecting 500k on a monthly basis, you just call that it's not enough. Because human needs are insatiable, it is never satisfied. If you make 2 million naira now and you shout and you are happy, another time you will still be like, okay, I want to make 5 million naira, you need more. So, but um, no matter the level you are, if you want to make more money or you want to be rich, there are some basic tests that you must pass in 2023. Delay gratification test. That is number one test. A lot of people, when they eat their first one million, they just become abnormal. They begin to buy something that they don't need to impress the people that don't care about them. So when you just eat your first one million naira, you start and you just take it and you go and buy iPhone 14 Pro Max. That one self, I think it's like one point something million. Or let's say iPhone, you bought like iPhone 13 Pro Max. And it's selling for a very very high price selling for like um, 800,000 or 700,000 naira. now if that phone is necessary for your business in fact when you make a million as profit it's not advisable to buy something that's worth 800,000 naira. so delay gratification is when you delay current enjoyment for future enjoyment take for instance when I started investing in e-commerce business importation real estate digital businesses there was a time i did a video training on how to make one million naira from e-commerce one of the comments i got was do you look like a millionaire and i was like excuse me so so i if i made my first one million naira, do you expect me to use them to buy clothes and eat and just i don't understand so that period, the first money I had, I was thinking, what should I buy? Should I buy a car? Should I buy iPhone? That was like in 2017 or 2018, when I hit my first million. Did I buy iPhone? What can I do? The first thing I bought was a landed property. And it made me not to even have money again, because as soon as I bought the landed property, I started building. I bought 1,000 blocks, bought 100 bags of cement or 50 bags of cement, and we started the foundation. So virtually, I spent almost the, the money in my building structure so i didn't really look like it because i really want to become financially free not really about the one million about what can i do more to make more so if you can't pass the test of delayed gratification when money comes to your hand and you you are just um you are just um uh, overwhelmed by let's say you are overwhelmed by what have you maybe uh, um luxury or material things it's not good so if you cannot pass the test of delay gratification delaying yourself of some present enjoyment for future enjoyment then you can't there are so many things i've invested my money on that even before i bought my first car i've bought a lot of landed property i've bought more than more than 30 plots before i even bought my first car so that is delay gratification if you cannot delay current enjoyment for future then for future enjoyment then you might not be rich because as money is coming to you you spend it money is coming to you you spend it now another test you must pass is the savings test you must give yourself a savings test if you pass that test you can be rich you you some people one of the things i used to ask them what is the highest amount of money you have ever saved when they come to me for financial information i have financial power, i have 50k what can i do this is the business i'm doing this work i'm doing i have been able to save 50 000. what can i do i tell them Go and keep that money in the bank, continue your work, save till you get to 300,000 naira. Save till you get to 400,000 naira, then come, I will tell you what to do with that 400,000. You 
become an automatic investor. You know, the economy is so strangulating now, just like my uh, TV interviewer used to say. So sometimes when you're trying to save your money, your family member can reach out to you. I need this money. Your, your, maybe if you are in school, school wants a share of it. You are living food, clothing, shelter. So there are so many things fighting for your income that you can't even save. But if you are disciplined enough to set your savings and after a period of time, maybe one year, you are able to save to a particular amount of money, then I will give you a thumbs up because when millions come to you, because you will be able to pass the saving test of discipline yourself and miss all needs, all wants, all access, as in people asking you from different places, give me this money, give me that money, give me that money, and you can meet those needs, then I mean, you, 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 you try to excuse yourself and you still say, then you can become financially intelligent because, I mean, financially free and rich. Because on the process of becoming rich and wealthy, there's so many things that will come to you that your discipline of savings, you just need to reapply it. Now, the third thing is the test you have to pass is a target test. When I was selling products for people, I could remember I never have up to 100,000 there. And I've made since the day I checked the dashboard, I saw that I made up to three million in assets for this man that I just started marketing for in one year. And I can't even account for twenty thousand and I earn in commission. So from that three million, I should be able to have made up to like three hundred thousand naira for me. But I couldn't account for anything because I was spending those money. So what did I do? I said, Paul, I'm gonna to save two hundred thousand naira. And it took me like four months. I saved hundred thousand naira, and that money was the beginning. Of my own personal business I started selling my own product with that hundred thousand yeah. so if you cannot pass the target test give yourself a target wherever you are working now I don't know how it wants to be but if you cannot give yourself a target and get it or savings you are not saving because you want to be financially free you are saving because you want to learn the discipline of saving because it's necessary to build wealth then you will be financially free in 2023 because there are so many things in the economy that want to eat your money up but if you have this um test if you're able to pass this test you will be able to make manage and multiply money so these are just the three tests that i want to talk about now i want you to click this video here it's talking about 23 money game there are so many um, things that i want you to do. don't just watch one video you need to watch like five or ten videos Get yourself equipped with a lot of money information that will help you make, manage, and multiply money. And that is why I put it in a playlist, the money game. So I want you to click on this video to watch it. I see in the other video that gives you information on how to make money in 2023. 2023 money game, click it and learn more. Thank you so much. Have a great day. Bye.